right guys, so one of the things that's gonna be very, very important for us to understand is where the weight is located. So we've mentioned that a couple times about knowing where the weight is located and how much more important that is than the actual weight itself. So I'm gonna grab a couple bats here. We have a 32, 24, drop eight, cat nine, one piece, and a 31, 23, drop eight, two piece, the connect. So you have two bats that are an inch difference in length. So we can see we got about an inch difference and they weigh an ounce apart. But when we talk about BPI, balance point index, these two bats are very, very similar. So why is that? Well, with the two piece bat, we're gonna get more of a inloaded feel, even at less weight and that balance point is gonna make it a slightly harder to swing for its weight. The one piece bat is gonna be a little more balanced so that heavier weight can be transferred to the ball a lot easier. Now, let's go to the lab and dig into this a little deeper. All right, guys, now we're back here in the lab, and I wanna go over these two bats we just pulled from the Marucci Clubhouse. Now, we talked a little bit about how length is important, but even more important is the weight of the bat, and then even more important than that is where that weight is. So we have two different bats, same drop weight, but they're, a, they're an inch difference. So we have a 32-24 drop eight one piece cat nine. Now this comes in at a 50 BPI, and we wanna see how that, how that correlates, how that measures up against a two piece cat nine connect in an inch shorter length. So if we have a player that fits in this BPI when going through the fitting, we're gonna show you that there's multiple options in different lengths that can help him based off of his swing characteristics. So we're gonna go ahead and take this bat off. We'll put this one back on here. And so the first bat we said was a 50 BPI. And when we look at this one right here, we're getting a 51. So when we're talking about the difference between a 50 and a 51 BPI, that's not a noticeable difference for the player. So a two BPI difference, once we get two points of difference in BPI, that's where MLB level players start to feel a difference. So as we go down the drop categories, we go to college, high school, all the way down now we're at drop eight, that difference is gonna be probably even bigger where they start to notice that difference. So a two BPI change is where we look at, hey, that's a different bat when we're going through a bat fitting. A 51 and a 50, they're gonna get the same characteristics, no change in kinematic sequence, but we can get to different zone locations based off the difference in length.